Good YouTube. Dorsey Mad Gaming here. And continuing on with the Immersive Innovative Series, uh, looking forward for Madden NFL 19, I would like to talk about the coaching and more in particular, coordinators, offensive and defensive coordinators. Now, I know what you're looking at the image here and you're thinking, DM, that's NCAA 14. Well, a lot of what I've been thinking about to make Madden more immersive actually comes from NCAA 14. It's surprising that Rick Dixon worked on 14. It's surprising to me that he's not implementing some of these same features into Madden. Let's be real. We all know Connected Franchise is dull. It's empty. It's 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 there's nothing there that 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 even screams immersive. Um coaching, the coaching career is what I want to hit on today. And you don't even have a coaching carousel like you have in NCAA. Granted, you don't I'm not gonna say you don't switch coaches as much in college as you do in the NFL. There's just more college teams than NFL teams. So you have a larger movement of coaches. But I think that it would be really cool, really, really innovative for Madden and really immersive if we were able to start our coaching career off as a offensive coordinator or a defensive coordinator. I think that would be pretty cool, you know. Um, and then from there, uh, be able to receive job offers and things of that nature to um, to coach for other teams or to become a head coach. And, and continue our career from there and use the same format as NCAA. Have a coaching skill tree and things like that. I, I really liked playing, controlling my entire team, being a head coach, because I know that if I did not have a good season, that my coach grade would reflect that, and it could in turn uh, deem me to be fired. There were certain goals that you had to meet and things of that nature, and if you met those goals, then that was great. If you didn't, it would lower your grade, and, and you would run the risk of being uh, terminated. And I really really, really like that. When you look at Madden, that's, there's nothing there for the coaches. I mean, you're, you're controlling the head. You know, you look at the player side of it, you know, that's a different story for a different day. There's really nothing there. Um, to me, the owner side is probably the most where you're able to relocate the team, um, change stadium prices and things like that. I don't really know if anybody is really into still doing those things with the owner as far as changing jersey sales and things like that, as in previous Maddens when it actually made an effect on your franchise. But I digress. Playing an offensive coordinator, playing a defensive coordinator, and getting the opportunity to advance your career in the NFL, uh, as well as establishing records for those coaches as far as games won and things like that, that would be really innovative for the Madden franchise. That would be really immersive and connected franchise to be able to do these things, allow you to create your own playbook, which they similarly pretty much have that in the game, but expound on that. Allow us to put together our own playbook, uh, both offensively or defensively. Um, and in the same way, you know, you just control the offense if you're the offensive coordinator, or you just control the defense if you're the defensive coordinator. And when it comes to the draft, yeah, you would have some input in the draft and things like that. I guess, you know, they, they're not going to make it to where computer drafts your players. But at the same time, I think it would be even more, I think it would be even better if when it came to the draft, you didn't get to select. You may can give your input, but at the end of the day, it's up to the head coach, the general manager to select those players. I think that would be really cool and push people to become a head coach so that they can call the shots as far as the draft. Because let's be real, the offensive coordinator and defensive coordinator, they don't pick the draft picks. They may have a say-so in who, you know, is picked, but the last decision is up to the general manager and the head coach and sometimes the owner when they intervene. So these are my analysis. These are my thoughts. I really like the way the NCAA 14 did it. Um, and, and Madden can take so much from NCAA. They really, really can. And I don't know why they don't. But like I said, that's why we're doing this series, the immersive, innovative series for Madden NFL 19. And, you know, sorry, y'all, I hadn't been really streaming Madden 18. I'm, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I'm just, I'm losing interest in it more and more uh, because it, it's, it's, the game is broken. I mean, they added stuff to gameplay, but they didn't fix the real gameplay. But I expect them to fix that in 19 when they move the player models and how the players act over to the Frostbite engine. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon to turn on notifications. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to comment down below. That's all we got for this episode. Till next time, y'all, and God bless.